In this lesson, I'll reveal seven tips for getting more traffic to your eBay listings so that you can capture more interest from buyers and make more sales. To make sales in a competitive online marketplace such as eBay, you need three things. One, a great product. Two, exceptional searchability to get people to your listings. Three, perfect item descriptions and marketing to get them to click the magical bid button. So, to really help you push your sales up, follow our seven easy tips to getting more traffic to your listings. 1. Optimize your title keywords. Do not pass by this tip thinking you have it sorted. Title keywords are absolutely vital to getting buyers to your listings. A huge majority of eBay buyers search for what they are looking for instead of browsing through categories. So what they type into the search toolbar has a major effect on whether you get the traffic you need to make the sale. To really make the most of your keywords, focus on using the most relevant keywords first. 2. Check your spelling. If you misspell, you won't sell. This is because spelling mistakes will not show up in search results, so you will reduce the number of people who see your listings by up to 80%. 3. Ensure you are using the best keywords possible by using eBay's research lab, Bay Estimate, a great tool which shows you how effective your keywords are in relation to what people search for. Another trick is to take a look at the keywords that are used by sellers whose auctions rank at the top of the results when you search for your item. You can check out Bay Estimate in the eBay research labs at http colon slash slash labs.ebay.com forward slash 4. Offer free shipping. This helps to shoot you to the top of the search results. 5. Consider your listing's finish time. Make sure your listing isn't going to finish at 3 a.m. when very few people will be awake to view it. You will get more visitors when your listings end at more popular times, which will increase the chances of your auction ending in a bidding war, perfect for bumping up the final price. 6. Put links up to your other items and or store as much as possible. For example, if you are selling ebook guides, you might list your How to Stop Smoking Forever one with a link to your How to Lose 10 Pounds ebook as many smokers fear that they will gain weight after quitting smoking. 7. Price competitively. To be the number one seller of your item, you need to price as competitively as possible. In order to do this, you must work out your overall costs involved with selling the item, including buying the item, importing the item, shipping and custom duties and so on, storing the item, listing the item on eBay, then paying the final value fees and shipping the item to your buyer. Once you know the real cost, you will know what your most competitive price can be after you take your cut. Keep in mind that if you are in a position to undercut other sellers, it doesn't need to be by much at all to get you the sale. I hope these tips help. My advice is to start implementing them one at a time until you start seeing results. Thanks for watching.